beginning to bite more than you can chew. You are recently overstepping your boundaries. How dare you? How dare you kidnap the reputable men in my community? Are you drunk? How many reputable men of this community have you kidnapped, including the Onowu of this great community? Stand before me, you talk about reputable. Hmm? I am not in that league of men who leaves their busy schedule to come for negotiation. I am not here to exchange words with you. Three days. Giving you three days to release my men. If I come back here again, I will burn down this palace. Oh, hey. oh, you think this little boys here scare me? Little boys who are still learning how to shoot. Now let me warn you. The next time you come here, embarrass one of my staffs like this, I will not only kill you. I will wipe your entire generation off this head cross, and that includes the men that are supporting you. Let this not repeat itself again. For all time's sake, I am giving you the last warning. I like your courage. But being courageous can lead you to a place you can never imagine. Have you forgotten? I will start by leaking that secret to your wife. Right? We'll start with that. Then the next time I come, we will see to this you just said. You wouldn't dare. Uh, would you? What is that? Is that something both of you are not telling me? Well, I think you should ask your baby king of a husband. Right? You know, he claims to be a good person. For us, he's a baby devil. Only what is he saying? Well, you have a deadline. Three days. I will not start telling your wife anything for now. But let's say. You extend this, your stubbornness, after three days. Then, we'll have a conversation. Three days. Oh, hey, yeah. 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 Oh, hey, once again, you're welcome, my elders. Thank you, my friend. My heart still bleeds over the demise of Ono. Ah, it's very painful, my king. Ono was a good man. 
he was a great man when he was alive. I think what we owe him now is a befitting burial. Yes, and you know is right. The only thing we owe him now is to give him a befitting burial. And as well, crown a new Ono as our tradition demands. Oh yes, um, <clears throat> my king, according to the tradition, the new Ono emerges immediately after the late one is buried. So we need to act fast. My elders, you have all spoken well. Your suggestions are good. Since we all have agreed to fund the funeral of our little Noru, we should also meet here together to conclude on the date. And then we should inform Chidendo that he will be the next Onoru as tradition demands. Do we understand ourselves? Yes. yes. Chidendo was actually supposed to be here, but he went to his maternal home. Did you see me ask about him? Of course I'm aware. He told me he had to be at a place, compulsory emergency, that he has to be there. So I'm aware. Yes, so when he comes back, we relate the nature of the meeting to him and tell him that I said that he should get himself ready. Do I make myself clear? We go on, we prepare for the burial of a no, and also the reinstallment. I am very sorry for your loss. I hope that God gives you the fortitude to bear such a huge loss. Thank you, my king. It's all right. Oh, no, he was a good man. He was a man that wishes everyone well. Man for the people. He wasn't just your husband. He was a father to everyone. I also want you to know that my cabinet members and I have agreed to take responsibility of, of his funeral. Thank you, my king. I really appreciate your kind-heartedness. I pray that the gods of our ancestors will bless you immensely. Oh, madam, please. You don't have to thank me. I'm only doing what I should do. I mean, your husband was a good man. He supported everyone. He wishes everyone well. He did everything he could to make sure that this great kingdom moves forward. We all owe him the respect of giving him a befitting burial. Mm. Ah. Oh. My love, mm -hmm. I have something very important to talk to you about. Okay. Baby, now that you know he's dead, I want you to talk to King Obiora. Let him crown you as the new Ono. Oh no, Lota. What, what are you saying? Ah, my love, are you not tired of saving your fellow human being? You have tried. Eh? It is time for the king to promote you. You need promotion. Oh, no. don't, don't say that. that. That will never happen. That, that is not possible. How sure are you? Have you discussed with the king? Hey, talk to him first. It's left for him to, to reply you. <laughs> it's okay, my love. See, you don't need to think about it. Though. You don't need to think about it. You have tried. You need promotion, baby. You need promotion. It is me, your wife. Who, I am the only person that will tell you the truth. <laughs> oh, okay, I... I will talk to him first and uh -huh. know what he has to say. Uh -huh. Now you are talking, my love. Eh? You have tried. You have tried. You need promotion. Eh? Talk to him. Tell him to crown you as the new Ono. Simple. Simple. You've tried. You said you have something to discuss with me. 
Oh, yes, yes. Um, mm -hmm. Nothing much, really, you know. You see, uh, both of us, we have come a long way. Oh, yes. Yeah, we have been through ups and downs, you know. I've been there for you, you know. I've shown that that um, act we call friendship, you know. Starting from when you were not a king to when you finally, you know. <laughs> so, um, it's not really a very hard something. I feel that you can uh, do for a long time, friend. You know. So, uh, let me just go straight to the point. You see, now, so we know whose um, position is vacant. So I don't think there's anyone that is qualified to be in that position, if not your best friend. So I am... Ah, <laughs> oh, Chikube, you can be very funny at times. I mean, you just sounded like one who is not from this part of the world. I mean, of course you know I can make you know. I can't. <laughs> so you can now, you can't. I, mean, yeah. I can. You should know I can't. Which one is you can't? I don't understand though. Why would you say you can't? Of course, you, uh, who else do you want to make your know with if, if not your best friend? Uh, wait, wait, wait a minute, Jacoby. Are you serious right now? Which one is that you, you, you cannot make me your know? So who else do you want to make your know? Uh, eh? Wait a minute, Jacoby. Don't tell me you're serious about this. I thought you were joking. I should be the one to ask you. I thought you're you're even joking. Because when I said it, you were laughing. I thought maybe you're you're trying to uh, digest what I said, or you like the idea. You you are the king of this kingdom. Whatever you say stands. What do you mean you 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 cannot do it? If you say you cannot do that, that means you're you're you're, you're just being corny. If you ask me, you're being corny. Yes, no doubt. I'm king. Uh -huh. But there are things I cannot do without. Listen, I thought you, you know those things. Onowu is an ancestral movement. Onowu is hereditary. Please leave this thing you're saying now. Which one is Onowu? Is Whatever you say in this village stands. If you call the, uh, anybody to tell them that this is your new Onowu, everybody will respect that. Which one is Onowu is hereditary? I didn't expect this thing from you. I was supposed to have this long conversation. It's not you just say, okay, my friend, thanks for reminding me. I will work on that. The next day, I'll come with my red cap and I'll become the Ono. Is there any other to, 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 to be done? Um, 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 um. Jacobia. I cannot do that. I cannot incur the wrath of the gods all because I cannot do that. It's impossible. Is that, is that what you're telling me? I can make you. Is that what you're telling your friend for how many years? You're, you're telling me you cannot do this. You're telling me to my face. No problems. I know, I know your plan in this life is for me to serve you forever. It's for me to serve you forever without doing anything useful for me. Just this one thing that I'm begging. Just, just this one thing that you can easily close your eyes and do for me. You're telling me you can't. Okay, no problem. This is unbelievable. I mean, what makes you think he could come up with such idea of becoming the next prime minister of this kingdom? How is that possible? Jacobi, you are grown enough to understand that Onowu is not what you can give to just anybody. He's hereditary. I cannot go contrary to the customs and tradition of my people. He should know that. I'm a custodian. I still can fathom what could make Jacobi think of becoming the next Prime Minister. My elders, once again, you're welcome. Igwe. Now that we have successfully buried our late Onowu, I think it's about that time we'll think of installing another. You're right, my king. As uh, the tradition demands, we all know that the next in line to become the owner is Jaden. And uh, all we need to do here now is to fix a date for his coronation as the new owner of this kingdom. Uh, my king, 
I think the next on-call market day will be okay. The next on-call market day? Are you sure it will be convenient for everyone, including Ezemo? Uh, my king, I think we should inform Ezemo. He's the rightful person to give us a date for the creation of our Ono. I think you're right, Uzochi. We should consult Ezemo so as to tell him the dates that we have fixed and let's know what he will say about it. Chekube, I can't. You can. I can't. Of course you can do this for oh, Chekube, me. I can't. It's not possible. What do you mean it's not possible? It's not possible to make, to make your best friend your know. Something I know you can do for me. You're telling me you can't. Chekube, this thing is hereditary. You are the king of this land. You have the power to change the customs and traditions. You know this deep down that you can do it. And then incur the wrath and the consequences. Which, which consequences? Leave these consequences. You're just doing this on purpose. You're, you're telling me you can't. You can do this thing for me. What is, is, is it not just to, to make me do no? Why is it hard for you to do? Well, I am sorry to disappoint you. I can't. And that's final. Oh hey yeah, This is what I've been saying. Eh? Imagine someone you have served for years. He turned down your request. Hey! Oh. So Obiora can be this weekend, eh? This 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 life is really a part of being so. Obiora. Obiora. <laughs> uh, uh. My husband. Okay. You know what? You have to continue to persuade him. You have to continue to persuade him. What is all this now? Eh? What is it? You have to. All these your years will not be a wasted years. He must make you the Ono. That boy I'm seeing is not looking like he will. Eh? You need to see his face. That you needed to see the way he was so mean. Like, like I'm just blabbing. Opiora. Eh? My love, you don't have to give up. Do not give up now. Lie, lie. You are going to be the next Ono. You are the next Ono. Mm. That's all I know. I'm beginning to suspect if Obiora really wants my progress. He claims to, to really want to see me grow. But with his actions, he's telling a different thing. Eh? Obiora looked me at the face and told me that he can't. That he can't. It's fine. Chekube. We're in this life together. Chekube. Chekube. Maybe you use your tongue to count your teeth now. It's okay. You see? No, can you see? I warned you about Chekube. I told you that one day Chekube's real color will come out to play. I asked you that you discharge him, but you refused to listen to me. Can you see it? I mean, how was I supposed to know that he will exhibit such traits? I guess I underestimated him. Now that you know, what is he still doing here? Why not send him away? What is he doing here? Oh, Rebecca, please, things don't work like that. Do not forget that Jacobe is not just my PA. He is my friend. I cannot just make such decision just because he is asking for the post of Onowu, which he already knows that Onowu is hereditary. It's not something I can give to him. It's not difficult for him to understand. <laughs> it's the gods for me. No, Chekube is asking for the position of the Nohu. What makes Chekube think that the position of the Nohu can be given to him? As who? Is he mad? He thinks because I am his friend, I can do anything, but there are limits to what I can do. Or Nohu's position is not something I can give to him. It's hereditary, point blank, period. Now. 
make hay while the sun shines. My king, as it is in the litany of our ancestral heritage, it is not in my power to choose or crown you know who. But as it has been done by those that lived before us, the Anukam family have been privileged to continually bring forth a representative to ascend the Onowu office by the consent of the gods we may proceed thank you very much as more you've spoken well um please oh. By the power vested on me as king of this great kingdom, I confirm you, you know. Thank you very much, my king. Cha 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 cha. The boy, you come. Come. Come, so no. I thank you for this great honor. The Onowu is hereditary, and I thank God that you people go according to the tradition. Thank you very much, my king. Oh no, my king. Oh no, my king. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh Greatness sitting down. Is that it? Which one is that now? Will you stand up and greet me properly? So I greeted you, you so you even heard the greeting. You didn't even respond. Nothing, nothing. I should stand up and please let's let's know what we're doing. What was it? What's today's plan? What's the schedule for today? She could be what F on tree if I may ask. First you now sit to address me. And secondly, look at the time you came to work. You and I were supposed to be at a meeting, a very important meeting by night. And this is 10 and you are still here seated and you're asking me questions. Have you lost it? Well, for the meeting, I, it escaped my mind. I've been very busy at home. There are some personal things that I was sorting at home personal things that you forgot your work, you forgot the time that I gave you that we have to be at a meeting? Shall we? Shall we? It's not only shall we, it's willy willy. Shall we to where? I've taken enough of your exercise because we have been friends since childhood. Oh, you remember? I urge you to always not just give me that respect as your friend, but as your king. Be very careful, Jacob. Yeah? Shall we? Can you just forget all the... 
leave all these things is not going to help us. So this place you're telling me to follow you to, am I following you there as what? Is it as Ono? Or I really want to know. Chekube, are we still talking about that matter, Ono? Of course we are still No, we are not. I've told you countless times that Ono is hereditary. As we speak, Mazi Chedindu has been announced. Has been pronounced the Ono of this great kingdom. And there is nothing I can do about it. Uh, and yet that you begin to understand this better for both of us. Now, can we? Heartless. I cannot believe that my childhood friend would do this to me. I have served you relentlessly. I have been there for you. Just this one thing, just this one thing that I beg of you, you cannot even do it for me. What you ask of me is something that has never been heard in the history of Ezoba Kingdom. My great grandfather did not do it, my father did not do it, I will not do it. The gods have already decreed who they want. It is hereditary. I've said this times without number. You are very, very, very wicked. I regret ever working for you as a PA. You look at me and, 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 and tell me your, your, your great father did... Me, after everything I did for you, after everything I did for you... Jacobin, what did you do for me? Should I remind you that everything you did in this palace, all the work, I paid for it. You want me to talk about your family? That I am taking care of everything about you is on scholarship. Who's footing the bill? Me! Be very careful with your utterances, Jacobin. I'm beginning to get fed up of your excesses. You're asking me what did I do for you? You open your mouth to ask me. What did I do for you? And look, let me tell you. If you like, get angry. If you like, shout from now till morning. You must be very stupid. You're asking me what I did for you. Now let me tell you. You see this PA work? Today is the last day. I am done working for you as a PA. You can give your no to whoever you like. That's, that's not a problem. It's fine. I have resigned. Jacob. Chekube! You, you see you, you're, you're very wicked. You're a very wicked person. So your plan is for me to serve you forever now? Huh? Your plan is for me to keep opening doors for you, call you Chai Tanji of Igbo land, so your head will be big. You're very wicked. It's okay. I'm leaving the palace for you. Says as a body, 
Really? So because Obira pays you, you are now his slave? Can, 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 can you just imagine? Obira of yesterday, because he's now a king. Tekube, you have suffered. I will so deal with him till he surrenders that throne. My love, whatever you want to do, I am in support of it. I support you full time. This is my kind of game. I'm good at it. You will see for yourself. I know what to do. I know what to do. So, <clears throat> that's how we shift. You know, shift. And you know what it means to shift? Your Majesty, please. I'm very sorry to disturb your peace. I'm very, very sorry, Your Majesty. Hey, now, why are you always running into my presence? What is it this time? Your Majesty, I'm very sorry. Your Majesty, I cannot believe what is happening. Chekube is parading himself as the new king of this kingdom. You cannot believe the way he is carrying himself like a peacock. Everybody is hailing him. Your Majesty, I was also marveled when I saw it. Um, that's all right, you know. You can, you can go and handle that. Okay, thank you. Go. Seriously? Chekube now wants to be the king of this kingdom. Oh, honey, please, I know what you want. But I'm not going to give it to him. I mean, how could it be heard or seen that I have issues with my ex PA? I mean, just don't worry yourself. I know how to handle that. Why? Now I'm asking you, why won't you? Chekube is out there parading himself like the new king and you sit here telling me that... What are you saying? Oh, Lord. I have no fear. Don't you trust me? Why are you bothering your beautiful head because of who? Chekube. Do not worry yourself. I know how to handle things like this. It will never be heard. Neither will he be saying that I have any sort of issues with my ex PA. My king, the worst is about to happen. And we cannot keep quiet about it. Chekube cannot wake up one morning and decide to rule this community. No. Not just that. He wants to divide the kingdom from what I heard. That he wants to be ruling the Umauka village. While our king will only be ruling the Amodo village. <laughs> Abomination. That has never been heard in the history of Ezioba community. Exactly. Not possible. <laughs> that boy is mad, he says. Eh? He's mad in his brain. He's not even scared. Eh? Only a co. A guardia atoya. On a big way. My elders, I've heard all you said. But I urge you not to bother your heads over Jacob. He is just a little boy seeking for attention, and I am not going to give it to him. I believe the problem here is overfeeding. By the time he becomes hungry, he will come back to his senses. My king, this is how he starts. If you cannot act now and stop him, he will do more. 
Uh, my king, taking action now is better than keeping quiet. Because you don't know this boy could come out and do something stupid. Like I said, my elders, stop bothering your heads about Jacobe. If Jacobe feels that he has become a man, there is no problem. Let him bring it on. But I promise you one thing, my elders. I, King Obiora, will not stand down. Well, my king, like I said, I think taking action now will be better than keeping quiet. Or else. Can we stop talking? about Jacob. Obira, seriously, I do not understand you. Why did you ask the elders not to worry about anything? Why? The people are not happy about this if you do not know. Even the elders are not happy about your quietness and response to them. Kings don't talk too much. When it's time for me to act, I will. For now, let me just keep watching Jacob. Eh? If you have chosen to disappoint me, Obiora, do not disappoint your people. Oh, my love, whatever decision you take, I am solidly behind you. You have my support. <laughs> that fool must be retired to think that I will. Watch him rule over me and my people after what he did to me. Never would that happen. That is his own cup of tea. And trust me, my love, he will drink it. Whether he likes it or not, you are the king. The one and only king of Omoawoka. I'm still waiting for him to come and confront me. Of course, I know he must have heard that I'm now the new king of Awoka. We are not scared of him. Of course, we are not scared of him. You should be the one to be scared of me. <laughs> Prime, you have my support. In short, I am going to call my brother. You know he's not in Nigeria. He lives abroad and he has money. He is going to support us. Like, he will bombard us. He will throw enough money on us. <laughs> it must be fruitful. <laughs> you see why I love you so much? What would I have done without you by my side? You are so, so supportive. You are my biggest fan. You are that woman that believes in me so much. I love you so much. I love you more than you know. <laughs> and of course, it will definitely be fruitful. Nothing can stop us. Um, I love you. You have to dress up so that you can meet up with the youths. Please, your cap is heavy. How do you cope? Well, wow. It looks good in you. <laughs> I have no idea how happy I am to see the youths of our land. It simply means one thing. 
It means that we all are ready for the change. It means that we all are ready to take over. It means that we want to put an end to sidelining our village. Are you ready? Yes, we are not ready. Are you all ready? Uh, we are ready. Full time. We are ready. Full time. Full time. Full time. Why not? Come on now. What is this? In Kadasi. Hmm. We shall see to that. Much ready. That's the spirit. I think you should go home and wash plates. Go home to your parents, okay? Okay, we'll start. Okay. Um I will get back to all of you. Please um think of seeing you all. We need to come together to form that formidable force. Is it that now or never? The good thing is that our people are abroad are in full support. Of course, most of them are ready to come back. Now, look at this. We have lots of youths in this village doing nothing. Graduates, no job. Now, with the help of our people abroad, they're ready to come back and invest. And of course, assist you people in your different occupations that you want to do. So, if we don't form that ally now, especially now that we have the kinship in our village, then when? Don't you tell me when? So, that is why I called you both. Go out there, tell other youths, tell them it's about time we did the right thing. Hmm? Are you ready to work with me? Igwe, we are grateful. Thank you for choosing us as your personal guard. And we are ready to do whatever you want us to do. We are very ready. That's the spirit. The fact is that I've been praying for this day to come. I'm very capable. I mean, we are capable of working with you for good or for bad. That's the spirit. Ndeba ese na anyo koma amirano obo fufu. So let's do this together. Hmm? Thank you very much. Medigos. My king, I am not happy. I'm not happy at all. Why will you allow this boy to overshadow you? Someone who wants to work for you. 
No. Please. Calm down. Don't tell me to calm down. I want to know. I want to understand why you are wise over this issue. Because I'm mature. How will it be seen or heard that I and my XP is someone who worked for me are at loggerheads? Oh. It doesn't make sense. And you think keeping quiet is the best option? Please tell him you know. I have been talking to him, but he wouldn't listen. No. If I say something about this issue, it will become worse. So, <laughs> you think when you don't talk, things will get better? It is when you don't talk that things get worse. No. You don't understand. You don't know, Jacob. He likes to talk. He likes to brag. He likes to argue. I cannot be seen doing that with him. When you ignore Chekube, that is when he feels worse. And that is what I am doing. So my king, are you saying you're not going to do anything about his action in this community? Chekube is about to tear this kingdom apart. You and I know that is not possible. I am still king here, no. The only thing Chekube is good at is making noise. Okay. If you say so, let's be watching. Chemdi, <laughs> you have to advise your friend though. You have to advise him. I don't know why he's parading around our community as the new king. When King Obiora is still alive, and him is not even from real family, what's wrong with him? My brother, you know Chikube very well. I know how he behaves. I have talked to him all, and he's not listening. So, what do you expect me to do? To slap him? <laughs> I cannot. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he knows what he's doing. Because if he does, he, he can never try this. See? <laughs> My brother Chikube, we all know he's a very stubborn human being. I have talked and talked and talked and talked and he's not listening. My brother, at this point in time, I've given up. How? Keep advising him. Oh. Keep talking to him till you talk sense into him. As if well. not, when the ghost anger will arose, when the anger will rise, you yourself, you, Jemde, <laughs> you are involved. They will catch you. The anger. Ah, that is poor boy. So look at look at you. Who's which ghost? Are you their messenger or the secretary of the gods? Yeah. No, 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 I don't understand. Yeah? Why would the gods even, even look, look my way? Am I Chekube's father? Mm -hmm. Or am I his wife? Am I even supporting him? If calamity will fall on him, let him fall on him. Nothing concerned. Let this be the first and last time you talk to me about Chekube. Use that same energy and go to his house and talk to him. He's not your friend. And so? He's not your friend. Uh -huh. Talk to him, oh. <laughs> talk to him, oh. It's not my business, oh. Go and talk to him, oh. Uh, uh, hey. uh, that man that we worked for, he said he will, he will give you our money. He don't pay. Hmm? Mm. He brought half of the money, so... Where is the half now? I kept it so that when the money is complete, we will not share Ask it. Ask my father. Brother, pick up now, eh? Hey! Ha! Brother, good afternoon, sir. How are you, brother? Um, eh, my husband is very fine, though. He's the reason I'm calling you, brother. Ah, no, there is no problem, brother. It's just that uh, this thing that I'm about to tell you is very important to my husband. He, my husband is coming out as the king of his, his village. And you know, if he becomes the king, it's going to benefit all of us. Hey, brother, he's the rightful heir to the throne. That throne is his own, is his own hereditary. Brother, please, you just have to do something. Eh? The opponent is very rich. 
the person fighting with him has money. And you know my husband is managing for now. So please, um, I said, let me ask you, brother. I will really need your support. Please. Um, like um, like three three hundred thousand naira for now, brother. Not not a. Uh, uh, it's not that we just need the money for three hundred for now. If you give us a hand, we can just solve our problem for now. Eh? Okay, brother. You you, you are still having you have that my account now that for one one. Eh, send it to it. Okay, brother. I'll be waiting for the alert, sir. I'll be waiting. How was your day? Productive as usual. Okay. This is three hundred thousand. It's for you. Where did you get this money? I told you I was going to talk to my brother. He was the one that sent me the money. Oh. I love you. <laughs> At least now you have enough money for yourself in case Obira comes off with any fight. Of course. You can fight. <laughs> she is just the best. <laughs> Thank you. Come here. Thank you. <laughs> Back on a fight with him because he was your PA. Where are you scared of? I am not scared of Jigube. Then act like one who is not scared. Rebecca, I've said this thing to you times without number. But act when the time is right. Oh, Vera, that is all you ever say. I will act when the time is right. I will act when the time is right. Obira, when will the time ever be right for you to act? Is it until Chekube puts his hand into your eyes then you know it is time for you to act? Obira, listen to me. Your offsprings will be disappointed to know that you are the first king to be dethroned. Now is the right time to act. Your offsprings will be disappointed to know that you are the first king to be dethroned. My love, I have something to tell you, and it's very important. Okay, go on. Um, if you drop the phone, this is very important. Oh, I'm sorry. Still, I'm trying to reply to a message. But it's okay, just, just go on. Okay, fine. Um, I need you to do something. 
so that you can have the support of the people. You need to do this so that in case tomorrow Obiora stands up to fight you, the people can stand with you. They can support you. Something like, like what? You have to buy bags of rice, beans, detergent, soap, and share it to the villagers. Trust me, with this, you will have their support. They will never forget this in a hurry. They won't. That was, that was great. <laughs> Man, that is a strategic plan. With this, surely, we will have the villagers to our side. We will have them singing praises to King Chikube. <laughs> but you know, buying all of this you just mentioned will cost money and you know we don't have enough we don't have what it takes to make it happen my love have you forgotten who my brother is my brother is not in nigeria he is outside the country and he has money so don't worry about it he will support us well i'm not disputing the fact that he will support us but i'm only consigned on the last help he rendered Remember he gave us a huge sum of money, he gave us the last time. I doubt if he would want to help us this time. <laughs> See, <laughs> let me tell you something you don't know. My brother loves royalty. Whenever he comes to Nigeria, he likes to associate with royalties. <laughs> so if my brother used his two left ear to hear that his sister and his brother-in-law are about to enter into royalty. My brother will support us with everything he has. Don't worry, I will talk to him. We will bring money. <laughs> Honey, forget it. Eh? Forget it. I told you I will talk to my brother. Mm -hmm. And he's going to give us money. <laughs> Brother, brother, hey, this is kinship we're talking about. Oh. It needs enough money to run it. Eh? See, let me tell you, brother, if we don't do like this, our opponent will take over the throne, oh, and it's not possible. You know, we, we, we've already gone far. Brother, please understand me. Hey, understand where I'm going to. Oh, brother, see, let me tell you, at the end of the day, this thing you will benefit me and you. You know. You know you already love royalty. We've already gone far, brother. It's nothing. Hey, please, I understand. We'll manage. We are managing. We are managing. Brother, brother, oh, that is my own brother, brother. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Ah, thank you. Igwe. Igwe. Why are you here? 
Well, we heard that you are sharing rice, so we came to collect our own. Yes, yeah, so Igwe, we went to the farms to work. And when we came back, we saw the women jubilating with their rice and uh, all the things that you shared. So we decided we should come with that our king is very good and we'll make sure we don't go empty handed. Of course, being good to my people is my biggest priority. No one is excluded in my benevolence. Get them their own share. Let's leave in peace. Let's leave in oneness. Stop fighting one another. And even in Udo, if you should come back next week for granite oil and of course red oil. Thank you, Igwe. Igwe. You will live long for us. Your reign will be filled with happiness. Thank you. This is unbelievable. Hey! Since I married into this village, no king has ever cared for our welfare before. Yes. Hmm. Rather, they will impose unnecessary law that is not relevant. I need you. Ha. Particularly King Obiora. That one, he has never, since he became king, never. My sister, they say charity begins at home. Yes. You can think about his father first because that one is the worst king ever. Very stingy. <laughs> hey! I'm glad this rice and full stop will last me two weeks. Eh, hey, no. Hey, to last me two weeks. I am happy when I heard King Chikube said that the women should come and pick rice and food stuffs. My sister. Hey! Were you the only one? I was happy too. Hey! Very, very happy. Sweetheart, tell me honestly, how do I look? Oh. Alright, I'm set. Shall we? I'm talking to you. I'm not going. <laughs> That's a joke, right? I changed my mind. What do you mean you changed your mind? This is a royal event. Every king is expected to come with their queens. What do you mean by you changed your mind? And this queen is going nowhere. Why? No, you tell me. I said, why? Since you decided not to act like a king towards Chekube, you can as well attend your events alone. Rebecca, can you listen to yourself? Chekube. Chekube is the reason you won't go with me to this royal event. Really? Stop this madness. Stop this stupidity. Bro, you call this stupidity. No, Obira, you expect me to sit here and watch Chekube take over this kingdom and we become commoners. Chekube can never, ever will take this kingdom from me. It's not possible. How many times do I make you understand that? It is happening already. Yesterday, he was sharing foodstuffs to the villagers. And you know what? They were praising him. King Chekube.
the fact that he shared few bags of rice to some indigents, some hungry indigents, that is why you feel that Chikube would take the throne for me. Can you comprehend what you just said? Is it possible? Laura, you don't understand. There are some things you don't understand about life. You talk as if you don't know that. People love where they get free stuff, where they get free money, free food, where they get free things. Enough! Not Jacobin, not this nonsense coming out from your mouth. Stand up, get ready. We are going for that royal event. Good afternoon, sir. Hi, how are you? <laughs> you are just coming back. Eh? Oh, yes. I just entered Nigeria. I said, let me come to my community and see my That's people. Right. That's very good. <laughs> good to see you. <laughs> you are looking good. <laughs> hey. Okay. Yeah. All right. You're looking good. All right. Thank you, sir. <laughs> hey. That's good. Though. That's the BEM. The BEM. Hey. He's back. Bem, he's back. Hey, King Chekubem will be glad to hear this. Okay, I will not hesitate to go and tell him. So, the Bem is back. Yes, my king. I would like to see him. It's not a problem at all, my king. Uh, you can send the guards to call him, and I'm sure. He'll be happy to hear that you are now the king of our Of course, of course. I know he will be very happy. I've gotten messages from those our sons living abroad. You know, they've sent messages to congratulate me on um, being the new king of our community. Hey. Our community. <laughs> so tell him I would like to see him. It's okay. Yeah, I would like to see him. Dubim! My king. <laughs> Wow, it's good to see you. How have you been? Oh, bless God. Bless God. Um, my king, so tell me, how did all these things happen? <laughs> of course, I know you'll be very surprised when you see this. Um, the thing is, uh, change, they say, is always constant. You're right, my king. I have decided that um, the community will no longer rule over us. But it's not done. I mean, we have illustrious sons, educated men, able-bodied men in this community. So why would they continue to rule over us? I woke up one morning and I said, no. It will never happen again. So I moved that motion of putting an end to that. That is what you're seeing now. <laughs> so the people of Amudo and the king tried to suppress us? Of course they tried, but that is in the past now because currently we are leading. We have what it takes. We have the capacity to rule over Amudo village and other villages as well. <laughs> You're right, my king. I agree with you. My king, my king! Dubem, uh, well, enough of um, our village and our, our achievements. Let's talk about you. How is your people? How is the family? <clears throat> um, um, everything is going well. You know, I left uh, Japan a few weeks ago. I said, let me just come down to the village and see my people. Uh -huh. So, unfortunately, when I came, I heard about the good news. I said, no, I have to go and see my king. Uh -huh. I have a few hotels that are building and there are some other things. Very good, that is what you want to hear. I just want to bring down development of our village and you know, help ah. the younger people. My son, you have done so well for yourself. Thank you so much. And we are very, very proud of you. Thank you so much, my 
As a matter of fact, we are solidly behind you. <laughs> Thank you, my friend. Thank yeah. you, my friend. Yeah. Yeah. As our hardworking son who has done so much for our community, he has carried our community's responsibilities with love and respect. Today, we have decided to recognize you. Hmm? As an I hear Lu and Kato or Megan, I got all. You can edge, see? No, not that. See? I can't edge any. Hmm? The hand you're using to give us. Hmm? Bless it today. Say, say, say. Today, I crown you Omelora One in Japan. Igwe Omelora One in Japan. <laughs> My king. I can't believe your attitude towards this matter at all. Can you believe that Chekube gave his chieftaincy title to one of his village men that just came back from abroad two days ago? And it is everywhere in the community. My king, we elders are tired. We can no longer keep quiet. Something has to be done before this boy takes over this kingdom. Exactly. Yes, my king. You need to do something. Before things get worse. Please. Chekube is only but a confused little boy. If I decide to reply Chekube's madness, it will be a disaster. And that, I do not want. Let me allow him exhaust his youthful exuberance. So, what do we do now? We sit, we fold our arms, and we watch. My king, my king. Chibeze. King Chekube of Esioma community. I greet you, sir. Good to see you, Chibeze. Thank you very much, my king. Good to see you too. Uh, my king, I'm here to inform you that I want you to give me a chieftaincy title. Mm. Yes, my king. Really? Yes, my king. My king, it's high time I acquire a chieftaincy title in this community. Well, um, that will not be a problem. Okay. I mean, um, you're one of the rich men we have in this community. Uh, not only being a rich man, uh, we appreciate the fact that you are always there to give back to the community. I mean, your scholarship scheme is uh, profitable to most um, families we have in our village. So you need a chieftaincy title that will befit you. Wow. Thank you so much, my king. Thank you for acknowledging that fact. Uh, my king, I would like to support you with two million naira. Mm. Yes. <laughs> I need a good one, man. Very sure. Uh, 
Okay. Thank yes, you very indeed. much. Yeah. Well, I have to discuss with my king's men, and I'll let you know the date. Okay, my king. No problem. I'll push up your wits. Awful. Thank you, my king. Thank you. Obira, I need you to tell me. What are you hiding from me? Because from your action, it seems something is wrong. My car. I've told you countless times. I am not hiding anything from you. Then why have you refused to confront Jacobi? Rebecca, not all matters should the king react to. I'm a king. Sometimes you overlook. Not in this case. This is a serious matter. You don't overlook such matters. I know it's a serious issue. But at the same time, I need to apply wisdom. What do you want me to do? Run on the street? Start exchanging words with my ex-PA? My boy? Is that what you want? Vera, listen to me. If you do not stop Jacoby, that means you are a weak king. Should I say you're scared of your boy, Jacoby? No, what is all this? What kind of a man are you? Your boy, Jacoby, is out there parading himself as a king in your community and you do nothing about it. Who does that? No, tell me. to see the king. Greetings, my king. Speak. My name is Stanley, the younger brother to Ken, that lives abroad. Oh, Ken, my good friend. I actually got off the phone with him not quite long. He sent me money to get a car for you. So actually I came to know if you, I should get the car for you or I should give you the money. I think you should get the car. I'm a very busy man. There's no time going to get a car. So you should get the car and deliver. Okay, my friend. Okay. I am very, I'm suspecting that that young man is using charm to control all these rich men. Imagine somebody buy him car just to take chief fancy title. Which charm? There's nothing like charm. He won their heart first. Don't tell me charm. Some, some he won their heart. He won their heart. Yeah, but he's wrong now. Before God and before man, it is wrong for him to claim, just make himself king. Okay, so amazing an evil. That one. That one. I don't like that that king, kingship is dragging. And, and the worst part of it is our elders, some of them, they have accepted to be his cabinet. I don't know why. I don't, don't, I'm tired of them. Oh, behold, it has to stop. Um, I need to even see that Chukube and talk sense into him. Or, or tell him out. I will turn him off. He don't do no sense in this village. Oh, oh, oh. Wait, we can't give me to know. Talk so, we, we sense. Now that me, I want to take my own chief tenancy title. I want to talk to you. Because you go come back. I'm going to look at you. I want to go. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Very soon you'll be calling me. Ebu, ka? Ebu? I'm going to be a dibia. I'm going to be a dibia. I'm going to be a dibia. I'm going to be a dibia.
Okay, come back, come, 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 come. Why is my food not served? Or didn't the cook come to work? I have some to take your thing off. Say that again. I asked them to take your day off. You asked them to take a day off? On whose authority? Without my consent, did you ask for my permission? When did all this start? It started the moment you stopped being the man I married. No, what is going on? Look at your boy Tekube, he's out there parading himself as a king and you do nothing about it. There will be no food in this house until you stop Tekube from this madness. Oh no, my queen. Oh no, you are the only one that can talk to my husband. Tekube has won the heart of the people and he is taking over the kingdom. Yet, my husband chose to be quiet about it. My queen, the king's quietness is bothering me as well. I have talked to him, yet he remains silent. Talk to him some more. No, you need to talk to him again and again and again. Talk to him, no. Make him see reasons why he should take action as a king. That is, if only he will listen to me. Because... He does not listen to anyone. What if you take action on your own? I mean, with the elders, you can stop Chekube from this madness. <laughs> By when? We can only do that with the permission of the king. We cannot do anything with our own power, if it does not permit us. That is why all the elders, I mean the elders are keeping quiet. My love, now that you have the support of the villagers, especially the people of Umuanka, I would suggest you hold an Ofala festival. Ofala festival? Yes. <sighs> Baby, you need to do this so that you can buy their hearts. You need to let them know that your reign is better than the reign of Opiora. Trust me, you will be respected. Especially before the Council of Kings. You have a point. Very strategic point. In that case, I'll have to inform the elders and let them know my plan. But then, 
arranging such events is going to cost so much. I know. You have rich men who you give chieftaincy title. They are going to support you. Have you forgotten? My own brother, he is going to support you. All it will take is just for me to talk to him. And trust me, you know I will talk to him. Ah, I will talk to him and he will bring the money. No, leave me. Leave me. You see why I always talk about you? You are my backbone. My greatest supporter. My love. I will always support you. Because you are my husband. <laughs> hey! Greetings, my elders. Greetings to you. You see, I invited you here to let you people know of the latest development. I am planning on hosting Ofala Festival that has not been done for some years now. Wow, my king. <laughs> it's a very good idea. The Ofala Festival, of course, has not been done in this village for over two years now. Exactly. And it's not exactly. supposed to be so. Of course, of course, of course. You know, the, so the idea is to enable our people feel that um, impact of kinship. Uh, this is not a tyrant season. Our people needs to at least have fun. Eh? <laughs> so let other elders know about this and of course let's start with the planning. Oh my king. Uh, go ahead with the plan and the arrangement. We the elders are solely behind you and we will give you our maximum support. Yes. King Obiora can never come up with an idea like this to entertain the people. Of course, of course. He doesn't have the capacity to host our father. But with all due respect, don't call that name here again. Hmm? Okay. So let my people know, okay? I'm planning on inviting um, other kings from the neighboring um, villages, uh, princesses, and of course, um, uh, I'll let the governor know of this arrangement, of course. Yes, my king. Can you leave now, my king? Shall we go? I guess. Yeah. I guess. Your Majesty! Your Majesty! Your what's happened? what is it? Why are you running into my compound? Your Majesty, Chekube is trying to organize an Ofala festival. The news is everywhere in the village. How will Chekube decide to organize an Ofala festival? What are you talking? Is he mad? Is he insane? I don't understand. Is it possible? Your Majesty, please. Please take action this time, please. Your Queen, please. Take action, Your Majesty. Please, I will be leaving. You see? No, can you see for yourself? Did I not warn you about this? I did. But well, you chose not to listen to me. Hello, DPO. I have something to discuss with you. Yes, I have something very important to discuss
it, sir. I hope there's no problem. Well, I think my king. You are looking for the king. king. The attention is there in the position. Honey! Honey! Good afternoon, Igwe. Good afternoon, gentlemen. What can I do for you? There's a petition against you by King Obiora. You guys can go. I'll call your DPO. Please, can you honor our invitation? I just said, you guys can go. I will come to see your DPO. For your due respect, sir. Please follow us. You must respect your uniform, sir. I'm so happy. This is what the king supposed to do a long time ago. Oh, yes. And if he had done it, this, this, this uh, uh, Chiku or what he called himself wouldn't have had the ghost to go and start planning on Fala. Oh, oh, oh. Fala Festival. Exactly. Yes, I'm talking to you. At least now, the community can have some peace. Exactly. Everywhere is calm. Yes. And we now know our king. We now know who is the king. <laughs> not, not an imposter. Imagine. J just look at somebody that is a player yesterday. Yeah. All of a sudden, they want to become king. Ask me. How is it possible? It's never possible. <laughs> eh? Okay, look at it now. Just that. He's not even royalty. Where? But he wants to become one. <laughs> even the... Royal blood is not flowing in his veins. Now he wants to become a royal. <laughs> when he does not even have royal, the blood does not even flow it's in not his veins. He doesn't have the blue blood. It's not possible now. How can he become a. No, no. Hello, Mr. DPO. It's me, the on the phone. <laughs> That's me, Mr. DPO. Uh, Mr. DPO, King Chekube of my community was arrested and detained in your police station for two days now by his opponent who is against his kingship. Um, we are worried and I want him to be released. Please, Mr. DPO. Oh, yeah, I know you're not aware because if you're aware, you wouldn't allow such a thing to happen. That's my DPO. Uh, I will come to the office and see you. Thank you, Mr. DPO. No. What is um, he assured me of his release. We will put a call across. So let's wait and hear from him. Okay. Mama, you see, you have nothing to do. I'm involved now, so everything will find you soon. I said this. I knew it, my love. Eh? I said they cannot arrest the ego, it's not possible. Dogumu, eh? DK, my strong man, my ego. Eh? eh? Hello, baby, what did you say? Okay, I should bring your regale. Which one? Which one? The white one. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh, okay, no problem. I'll bring them. You need that your your okay, yes. Eh, uh, okay, we did it. No problem. My Igwe, you're coming back in a grand style, my love. They go here me. <laughs> okay, that's it. Uh, yes, I'm, I'm rushing. I'm going inside. I'm since Obiora has decided to involve the police in this, I will not talk to him. Silence, they say, is the best answer for a fool. You don't need to say anything to him. Because if you do, he will know your next move. Can you imagine that fool? The things involving the police will scare me. Eh? Story, scare you as what? Who is he? Wait, wait, wait. Who is Obiora? Is it because 
He is the king. See, let me tell you, my husband, if they remove that kinship from Obiora, Obiora cannot afford three square meals a day. This is as useless as nothing because it's opportune. Uh, uh, his late father le left a uh, few change for him. That's why he's just up, up, up and about. Uh, who is Obiora? Obiora of yesterday. Well, let me not say much. I still maintain that I will not even talk to him. I will not even notice him. I won't. See, um, my love, you have to go on with your father festival. I am suddenly behind you. See, let me tell you, the people, we are all behind you. Uh -uh. Hey, that is my Igwe. Igwe! Greetings, as a more. Jacobe, a stubborn fly, they say, follows the corpse to the grave. To what do I owe this visit? There is a saying that a river does not flow through the forest without bringing down trees. I have come to warn you. Stop self acclaiming yourself as a king. You were never crowned one. In the lineage of your forefathers, none have become king. I will not warn you again. The gods have spoken. Babe, Igwe, are you, are, you, are you going to listen to him? Talk is cheap. He's already threatened. That is why he sent the Ezemo to come to me. But he's only speaking English. Greetings, young maiden. How are you? They're fine. Bless you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Majesty. Greeting, my princess. Oh, it is well with you. Thank you, Ma. You're beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> she said, I'm beautiful. Raise my hand. I told you when somebody helps me, you raise my hand. Oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> you can Let's leave in one <laughs> Stop fighting one another. I need to be a I can no longer walk around freely in this village without people mocking me. Imagine Lotachi. She's out there parading herself as the queen and the villagers are bowing before her. 
Jacoby came back from the police station. With band boys, crowd, they were rejoicing and you sit here doing nothing about it. What else do you want me to do? I've arrested Jacoby and I also got him out. Do you expect me to arrest him for the second time? Is that what you want? Abira, stop asking me questions. Act like a king. Act as a king that you are. You can pass an order and Jacoby will be banished. Oh no. Things don't work that way, my love. Not until the God's decree. I cannot banish Jacoby. Obiora, lies. You and I know that you can banish Jacoby if you choose to. Yura, what is this? What kind of a man are you? Why is it so difficult for you to handle Jacoby? Why? Yura, I am telling you, you better do something. Yura, you have to do something about this before I do it myself. And of course, you know that would be disastrous. I have tolerated Jacobe's excesses because he's my friend. Jacobe thinks I'm a coward because I have been keeping quiet. Not knowing that I allowed his excesses because he's been my childhood friend. But he has just awakened the beast in me. <laughs> Finally. Finally, my husband, the king, has decided to wake up from his deep sleep now that it is too late. It's not too late. It is only the beginning of a new dawn. Henceforth, Jacobi will see and feel the other side of me. There is no need talking too much. Action is all you need to stop him from holding the Ofala festival. You're right. Action, they say, speaks louder than words. Jacob, wait for me. Where is Demon? He went to assemble the props. This is the second time I'm assembling you all and Demon is not present here. Monster. Monster, you take this message to him. I want you all to go to Anwaka village for peacekeeping. Make sure you coordinate peace over there. Do you understand? Yes, yes, Anyone who tries to act otherwise, you bundle the person and bring him here. Do you understand? Yes, yes my king. Do you understand? Yes, yes my, my king. king. Good. You may go.
nine. What is this I'm hearing? Eh? Kene me. Ne. Honestly, what is happening? I am dumbfounded. My hands are tight. It's beyond my explanation. The series of kidnapping here and there, honestly, is what I cannot explain. Imagine the other day, Ichi Azuna was kidnapped. And who knows who is going to be the next person? Honestly, I am scared no. of what is happening. And I want to believe that it has something to do with the issue between Chekube and Obiora. But let's watch and see. Nani. I am very sure it is between the two ways. Now you have to do something. You have to do something. If not, I will run away from this village with my children. My children are very important to me. Ekuchekwem. Ekuchekwem on nine. Now calm down. You see, like I told you, my hands are tight. But I am gradually observing something. You understand? Like you said, you might be wrong. All right. I can say. But one thing I know is that I started experiencing this thing ever since it started having issues. Oh, yeah. But if I observe it to an extent and the thing continue to go on like this or get worse, I will have no option than to carry you and my children and myself We zoom. Zoom off. Period. Yes. Because Period. our lives are very, very important. I wouldn't want us to be killed. You understand that just it? No, but for just no cause like that. Ah. My life is important for me. I waited for you last night, you didn't come out. What happened? <laughs> Wait, oh, do you mean to tell me that I did not hear that gun last night? That to, 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 you didn't hear anything last night. Ah, no. My father locked up the door, so nobody should go out, and me, I was scared. Don't want to die, Biko. Hmm. No, that is another thing, oh. That gun was heavy. Mm -hmm. was, do you know it was Obiara's gang and the Chekube's gang? They had clash last night. Hi. Big clash. And do you know that the bullets were not penetrating? They were... Ah! Boom! 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 It wasn't even entering any of them. Hey! Thank God you did not come out of Hey! Thank God! Chikube again. Those boys... I don't even know who gave those boys gun. Huh? Who gave them access to be using gun in this community? Does the police know about this? Huh? This is getting out of hand though. One thing I am here to understand is why Chikube and Obiora we recruit boys all in the name of guards. Eh? And robbers. That's what they are. Look at the way they were firing each other. Bullets were just going. It wasn't even penetrating. Um, wait, though. Did you come out last night? Hmm? Um, mm, did you come out last night? I'm trying to find out. <laughs> so, you did not come out last night and you are telling me to come out? Not come out last night yet. <laughs> Hi! Mm -mm. Wait. Man, sweet, I don't tire. I don't tire. Do you know those forms we fill for the recruitment for security? 
people say they don't come recruit boys. They even come let us know. How? I don't understand. Let me see. You know this village. You know here gone shot last night. Those oh. gone shot now. Those boys who they recruit now. Oh. And then they shoot. They gone shot. Hey now. Listen, let me tell you. You got it all wrong. How? The gunshot you heard last night came from both kings. They are boys. Chekube's boys and Obiora's boys. They were having clash. In fact, they were firing each other. Pia, pia, pia. They had clash last night. And the, the thing is that the bullets were not penetrating any of them. Uh -huh. I'm telling you. Hi. Uh, this is serious. This is serious. What is this? Greetings, my king. Demon, my king. Monster, my king. Python, I have received information of what you guys did at Awoka Village. I must say, I am super proud. Thank you, my king. No, I should be saying thank you. Now Chekube will understand that I am not grooming boys but mercenaries. Thank you, my king. You will be rewarded immensely. Demon! My king. As soon as another operation comes up, I'll let you know. Thank you. But well, before king. then, take the boys back to the base. Thank you. Sweetheart. Now you're acting like the man I fell in love with. With your love, support, and ginger, am I not supposed to be a superman? At least now Chikube has felt a little bit of my hit. I'm sure he would want to retaliate and then he will see the true beast in me. Mm -hmm. All thanks to you. Thank you, sir. Mm. Let's go in and celebrate. That's right. Celebrate. Aha. Aha. Where are you looking? Good up. Good up. I didn't plan to come back here like this. But urgent matters calls for urgent attention. I've come to warn you, boy. Stop kidnapping my people. Is that why? Is that why you brought them? What do you call them? Boys? Now here is the main warning. If you do not stop parading yourself as what? King? I will kidnap every one of your last friends. I mean those sponsoring you financially. And I mean every word of it. The next time I come back here, first, I will castrate the backing dog. After that, I won't say much. Yeah. Yeah. 
That boy mercilessly. He has the effort to kidnap a son of the soil? Has he gone mad? I'm asking, has he gone mad? My king, we need to do something and do it very fast. If it means involving the police, we have to do that. No, did I hear you right? I, King Obi, or I involve the police with who? Chekube. Are you listening to yourself or no? I should involve the police because of Chekube. If Chekube feels that he has become a man, then let's do this man to man. No, my king, you are right. That boy needs to be taught a lesson of his life. But somehow, I still agree with your law. For legality, if there is need to involve the police, please. Ichi, that is an act of cowardice, if I must say. My husband, the king, is not a weakling. If not for the respect I have for you, I would say I am disappointed in you. No, what are we talking about here? Jacobe? Jacobe is the reason I will involve the police. Are you listening to yourselves? No. Jacobe will feel my heat. My king. That boy in our speed, though. We need to stop him. Good to hear ya! In what land? Your faces are not looking bright. What seems to be the problem? My king, the owner of this kingdom has been kidnapped. What did you just say? Oh no, has been kidnapped? Yes, my king. 
You know who was taken last night by Chikube's men. We have come to inform you about it. We beg to leave now. Oh. Jacobe, Jacobe, a baguma can order. Mate, go, Boma. You work with an honor, man. I had a tomorrow and a quarter. Oh, no, work it. <laughs> Let me call you back, girl. Yeah? Hey, that is my husband. Just see how you are shining. Hey, oh, just look at how this outfit fits you, my lord. Hey, Igwe! Hey, Hey. You did well by kidnapping that stupid Ono. You should have been the first person you have taken out since. I don't know why you were wasting time. Now that now we that know, know who has been kidnapped, kidnapped. let me see. Let me see his next action. action. Oh, oh. <laughs> My love, he will not do anything. He does not have anything inside of him. Owe ye do yani ime. Iwe cannot do anything. Owe ife do yani ime. Nothing is inside of him. Ah, Iwe. The next person on the line is his wife. I am going to slaughter her. Don't pay. Don't pay. She was involved. She was used to feed on. Iwe.
Please, I have to go now. I don't have much time again. Like you already know, Chibuzo was kidnapped last night. I don't want to be the next target. You are right, my son. Eh? But please, do take care of yourself. Mary, get your wife. Mama will take care of myself. Huh? Promise me you take care of yourself too. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Mr. Traveler, you think you are smart, Abi? I, I really don't know what you people want from me, please. I, I have families to take care of, please. Shut up! I mean, when we went from your mouth, eh? Why are you your cerebral? See, I, I, I really don't know what you guys want, but please, don't, don't, don't take me away, please. Shut up! Don't take me hey, move! Idiot! Move! Pull out! Pull out! Come! Move! Don't touch my mouth, please. Don't worry, okay? Don't panic, we won't kill you, okay? Just move. Move! Move! Beginning to bite more than you can chew. You are recently overstepping your boundaries. How dare you? How dare you kidnap the reputable men in my community? Are you drunk? How many reputable men of this community have you kidnapped, including the Onowu of this great community? Stand before me, you talk about reputable. Hmm? I am not in that league of men who leaves their busy schedule to come for negotiation. I am not here to exchange words with you. Three days. Giving you three days to release my men. If I come back here again, I will burn down this palace. Uh -huh. You think this little boys here scare me? Little boys who are still learning how to shoot. Now let me warn you. The next time you come here, embarrass one of my staffs like this, I will not only kill you. I will wipe your entire generation off this head cross, and that includes the men that are supporting you. Let this not repeat itself again. For all time's sake, I am giving you the last warning. I like your courage. But being courageous can lead you to a place you can never imagine. Have you forgotten? I will start by leaking that secret to your wife. Right? We'll start with that. Then the next time I come, we will see to this you just said. You wouldn't dare. Uh, would you? What is that? Is that something both of you are not telling me? Well, I think you should ask your baby king of a husband. Right? You know, he claims to be a good person. For us, he's a baby devil. Only what is he saying? Well, 
you have a deadline. Three days. I will not start telling your wife anything. For now. But let's say you extend this your stubbornness after three days. Then we'll have a conversation. Three days. Oh hey yeah. Oh hey, 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 oh I cannot have this conversation with you. Let's talk tomorrow. What was that? Why are you not sleeping? Who called? Um, a custom officer in charge of wares and jewelries. He just called. Why is he calling by this time of the night? I don't know. I mean, I wouldn't know. But if you listened, you would see that I cautioned him. I mean, how would he be calling me by this time of the night? But he said it was a matter of urgency. But I still cut the call and come on, it's nothing. Let's go back to bed. Jacob said something about secrets today. I'm going to ask you again. Is there something I should know? Why are you breaking my heart? Why will you choose Jacobi's words over mine? Really? <sighs> Don't worry, I'll unlock the phone and make that call so that you hear the voice of who God. <sighs> I'll never hide anything from you. Should I make the call so that you can confirm who God? I'm sorry, baby. I'm sorry.
Fighting for the throne, and who is gonna be king? Did you prepare this food or the cook? The food. Very delicious. My phone. I can pick that call. The person calling me wants me to get involved in a business I am not interested in. Really? Yeah, really. What about the money? Are you going to leave him to die there? Of course not. I already made plans on how to get Anova released. Can we stop talking now and just eat? Hmm?
Hello, darling. What do you want? Come on, don't be aggressive, okay? I miss you. Listen, you need to stop calling me. My wife is beginning to suspect. Isn't it better? Isn't it? At least she will know oh, that, that you have, have a beautiful damsel out here. That's better, isn't it? I'm not playing games with you. What do you want? Good question. I need a sum of two million naira. Are you out of your mind? Have you gone insane with you? Two million naira for what? Really? Is that what you're saying? Or you think I'm joking? Fine. You know what? Don't send the money. And watch me walk up to your wife and tell her how we've been doing it every night. Have you forgotten? All right. Fine. I'll give you the two million and you stay away from me. Good. You know you're a good king. My king. May you live long. All right, I'll be waiting. And I hope you still have my account details. Yes. my position. How does it feel though? Do you know I can kill you now and feed your body to the vultures and no one would do anything about it? How? Are you, are you, are you, are you asking me that, that? How dare you ask me that stupid question? You're asking me how? You ask, you're asking me how? Now listen. I just want you to do one thing. That's if you still want to return to your family alive. I may consider that. That's if you're obedient. You have to call your useless king. Tell him to step down. My king is not useless. Are you, are you mad? Are you, are you mad? Are you talking to me? How dare how, how you talk to me, fool? Just hold on. Let me make this call without you saying anything. That means it's all over. Hello. Hello, King of Yora, please. Sorinda, he wants to kill me. I don't want to die, please. Good boy. Do you still have anything to say? That boy just said I should go to hell. Looks like he doesn't want you to leave anyway. Go to Mwauka village. Oh, go, go 
forest to be precise. There you will find you know who bring him back alive. And whoever tries to stop you, crush that person without mercy. Have I made myself clear? Yes, fighting for the throne. And who is gonna be king? Right. Then, but more, you know those things now. Which little me to talk. And don't forget, let me fish. Let me arrange our way. Man. Well. Ah, we're not admin now. No, we both firm kita nyam tak di jam 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 kacik. Watch very well. Yeah, as he has. But I'm hungry now. Oh no, oh no. Me, I'll give you bullet now you eat. you people trying to tell me now? What nonsense? How can you be so careless? How could you? Nonsense! 
I pay you well and make sure you guys lack nothing. But just to get out. Get out. Listen, now see, Opira has rescued him. He'll be thinking now that he's on top of the game. <laughs> Opira had the gods to send us rats to poison my men. Well, it only means one thing. He wants my to game. die. And I must help him achieve that. Whatever we have to do, we have to do it fast. Because we don't know his next move. My next move will be deadly. My king, I thank you very much. You really saved my life. Oh no, please. Please, you should stop thanking me. It is my duty as king to keep an eye on every son of the soil in this kingdom. Please, you will be staying here for a while. We'll thank the gods that your family was not around when the boys came. Thank you, my king. But I still want you to involve the police. <laughs> oh no. I should involve the police for who? Jacobe, that little boy. Oh no. Do not worry yourself about Jacobe. Go in, take a rest. When you wake up, we'll give you something good to eat. As for Jacobe, when it's time to handle him, I will. My king, I I thank you again. But if something is not done, he will not stop. Oh no. Just because he has summoned some rich boys to back him up doesn't mean he's strong. Like I said earlier, take your mind off, Jacobe. When it is time, I will show him the stuff I am made of. Hmm. When it's time for me to act, I'll crush all of them. Hmm. For now, go in and rest. Is there supposed to be a problem here? I told you. That's only a call. A male caller. Are you relaxed now? I know all your friends. Why are you hiding this particular friend from me? Can we not talk about this? It's only a call. A male caller. Excuse me.
Just a friend. <laughs> a friend? What are you hiding about him? What could I possibly be hiding about him? Hmm? So you want me to believe there is no secret affair going on between both of you? <sighs> Babe. Have I ever held any secret from you? Ever since we met, have I? So why do you keep rejecting his call whenever you are with me? Why? Whether you are there or not, I do not take that call. He's trying to involve me in something that does not concern me. He has business, whatever, with Chekube. He wants him dead. He's asking me to associate with him. I cannot be involved in that. I told you that before. That is why I am not taking that call. Are we clear on that now? Now you know why I am not picking any of those calls. So there's someone else who wants Chekube dead? No, you know. So why not terminate him so that all this problem can stop? I've told you there's countless times. The time is not now. Do not worry yourself. When the time is right, you will be the first to know. This is not happening. It won't happen. Can you beat that? Can you imagine that I went to the place we have King's meeting, sit there, there was Jacobi as King. How dare him? This will not happen. Was he allowed to be part of the meeting? How can you even ask such a question? What meeting? Of course the meeting did not hold because I disrupted the meeting. My king, this is why. I asked you to involve the police because we are no more safe in this community. All the elders ran away, the villagers traveled because they don't want to be killed. Oh no, let this be the last time you talk about police in anything that concerns Jacobe. Jacobe, I'm supposed to involve the police for Jacobe. Listen, oh no, let this be the last time. Jacobe is a little boy and I will fix him. People are dying, kidnapping everywhere. Innocent people are being killed. Please, just involve the police. And if you cannot do that, why don't you see him to court so that all this nonsense will stop? Oh no, there is no court, no police. The fight has already started. Let him exercise his power and let me exercise mine. Let us find out who is really king of his other kingdom. Hmm. If you say so. Ha! Odogu! Igwe, you are welcome. Igwe! <laughs> My lord, how did it go? Of course it went well. The coward came to disrupt the meeting. What? As he was held accountable for his actions. The chairman of the Igwe Council warned him never, ever 
to come for any royal gathering. When he left, guess what? The meeting continued. <laughs> Serves me right. My love. I'm so sorry about it. It's okay. Uh, you should be sorry for yourself. He went out and the meeting continued. <laughs> like seriously? Yes. That is my evil. <laughs> That idiot that is pricing us cover cover half half for that war. Let me tell you something. If everybody in this village will let them run away to a contom, I don't care. This will be possible. I don't fucking care. Don't care. Me, Chem the chairman. I'm not going anywhere. I cannot run because of that nonsense boy. I cannot. He dare not try nonsense with me. Even where the point gone at you. Oh, the Kube asked the boy to, to, to shoot you. you which, see? which gun? That gun is boss. The kind of and it's not real gun. No. It's not real gun. I am the only person Chukube is afraid of in this community. I am the only person that can walk up to him and tell him anything I want. He will not do nonsense. If yeah. he tries nonsense with me, I will call him as a pursuit. What nonsense? And you did not do it the day he asked. His boss will chase you out. Ah, didn't I tell you? I was praying that time. Oh, me that was in fasting. If not, if not, I was in fasting that day. He asked his boss to take me out of his compound. Now, mm. Let him try it now. No, 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 no. Let him. So if you are his spokesperson, go and tell him to try nonsense with me, Keta. Do like this. Ta, go no do like this. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Stop, stop making noise! You, you, you stop! I'm about to the boss of what? Go and look for money so that I will go and eat. Are you in touch with compound? You? I don't like that compound. They have juju in their compound. You know, they, uh, so, me that is not afraid of juju, you want me to be afraid of ordinary chukube? That I'm even the one that show you where to get the juju. Are you afraid of juju? I don't blame you. Are you afraid of ordinary chukube? That I'm even the one that show you where to get the juju. I don't blame you. Just go and get money so I will go and eat. You send, the, you send that to the boss. Ah, no, no. ah, shut up! Stop, stop, stop making noise! No, 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 he knows me very well. Look, my visit here is very important, so just go inside and tell him that I want to see him. Who's there? My queen. Say that name is Vivian. That's I am. Okay. Come in. Okay. Greetings, my queen. Greetings. How may I help you? <laughs> My queen, I'm not here for you to help me. Rather, I'm here to help you. My name is Vivian. Speak and... no more. <laughs> hey, my king. Greetings, my king. Look who we have here. <laughs> Isn't it nice to see you? How are you? What's your friend? So I decided to give you a surprise visit. Just because you became the king, you forgot me. Hello. Can someone be nice enough to tell me what is going on? Sweetheart, you have nothing to worry yourself about. This lady you see right here, she used to be my very good friend while we were in school. And a lot of people think we were really good because we were fond of each other. Yes. No strings attached. <laughs> All right, that's fine. You're welcome, Vivian. Thank you very much, my friend. That wouldn't be necessary. Head it out. So, since I wouldn't be around, she could just uh, roll with me and then we'll talk things over. Oh, um, that's fine. Right. Um, that's fine. Right. I'd love to spend some time with your wife, okay? Some other time. <laughs> so for now, I'm dashing out, and there is no way you're not coming. The love of my life. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
see you soon. Okay. I'll see you soon. Careful. It's I my will be. my friend. Why did you set foot in my palace? What is wrong with you? We had an agreement. I need more money. What do you mean by you need more money? I just gave you 10 million naira two days ago. What did you do with 10 million? Well, I need more. I am not giving you a dime. Then watch me tell your wife about us. I'll tell her. You will not dare. Vivian, you will not dare. I am not joking. I will tell your wife about us. Blackmailing me, Vivian. It has come to you blackmailing me. After what we shared. What did you do for me? What? I don't care whatever it is you did for me, Your Highness. Come on! My God, my God. No, 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 no. I have to stop this game. I can't do this anymore. Hello? Look, where are you? I've been here for the past one hour. I even dozed off in my car. Look, I can't wait for you any longer. I, I have to go home. I'm going home. I just had a terrible dream. I'm not comfortable here anymore. You know what? Meet me at home. I am no longer interested in this game. I want out. What do you mean you're no longer interested in this game? Obiora needs to be taught a lesson for cheating on his wife. Look, I have a very bad feeling about this, okay? I had a very bad dream last night, and in that dream, King Obiora shot me. Can you listen to yourself? You're trying to back out from a multi-millionaire deal because of a mere dream? Really? A mere dream, you say? What if it happens? What if King Obiora attracts me and kill me? That is the main reason you have to act fast. Make this happen and get your money. Look, I just 
came here to tell you that I am no longer interested in this game of yours. Please go settle whatever issues you have with him and leave me out of it. I'm done. You, you, you can't say that, okay? I mean it. I don't want to die now. Really, I don't want to die. I'm out. So that girl had to quit. I never knew she was such a coward. Vivian Boma girl. She's simply scared of death. Oh. She's scared of death. But she's not scared of sleeping with another woman's husband. Honestly. This development is really not what I bargained for. Vivian promised me. She promised that she was going to expose him. And now this. And you know he's our only source of income. Eh? I don't know. I don't know what to do now. Em. I have an idea. Yes. I will go to his wife and expose him myself. That is it. I'm going to expose him myself. It's not easy as you think. Rebecca will not believe you until she sees proof. We really need to come up with another plan. Another plan. I want you to go to Amudo village. Make them feel my anger. Give them a little bit what my rat looks like. Bundle every man, every woman, anyone who stands on your way. If Jacob's boys try to stop you, bundle them here, dead or alive. I made myself clear. Have I made myself clear? Yes, my king. I am going to take you all over. Not only will you feel my wrath, my anger, that will come to the end of this war. And who is gonna be king? Thank you. 
About it. It's gone. It's okay. Calm down. Calm down. Come on, calm down. This is your shot. I wish. I wish. It's okay. It's okay. They have killed my son. They have killed my son. No. Hey. I'm finished. Hey. Our kings. Our so-called kings! Right. Hey! Hey! So these two kings are still fighting in that village. No, 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 this is ridiculous. Calm down. I want my junior. I want junior not to go out. Or he wouldn't listen. Don't tell me to calm down! Calm down! Calm down! Calm down! Calm down! Hey, down, down. I'm finished. Sit down. Come here. Sit down. See, I want to. I want to promise you something. Hey. Make sure. Okay, people. Don't try What nonsense is this? This wasn't what I asked them to go do. Go protect my people, and they went there to do something else. Now the commission of police has been calling me. The local government chairman, they've all been calling me. How do I explain? My king, you don't have to blame the boys. It was your instruction they carried out, and it turned out to be a disaster. I just said that I did not send them there to cause any disaster. I sent them there to protect my people. That was what I just said. I 
ask them to go and beg, please. Have you seen what you've cost? Have you seen what you've cost? I gave a direct order. Go there, mount surveillance on Chekube's boys and not to allow disaster to happen. You were there. You couldn't stop his boys. Have you seen what you've cost? I am king. I am supposed to protect my people and not to kill them. We are sorry, my king. Will you shut your trap? Demon. My king. You were there. Your discipline is to take orders. And not break them. A little boy has been killed! My subject! My son! Madam, I did not send my men to do this. My men can never kill a child. I don't care! What of your blood suckers? Uh, uh, woman, listen, okay? I know how you feel, and I'm sorry for your loss, but truthfully, I did not send my men to kill your child. Hey. I didn't! Hey! Agnes is, Agnes is okay, calm down, eh? My husband just told you that he did not kill your child. Don't tell me to calm down! Eh? Don't tell me to calm down! You are a bad woman! You support to husband to kill us souls! Yes! Happy we are all gathered today as one people. Chekube, from all ramification and by tradition, you are not a king. You are not crowned one. You are not even from a royal family. So I see no reason why you should dare to tear this kingdom apart. Chekube here worked for me for so many years in case he has forgotten. No, that is not why we are here. Nobody is asking you. Of course they know. Okay? Just go straight to the point. That is not why we are here. Kingdom is on fire. Kingdom is on fire. It all started when we lost the previous no. Shikube here wanted me to install him as the next no, and I refused. Onyegabuze, 
So I have to go. Oh uh, no. Sir. You see, I I can't thank you enough for all you've been doing in this palace. You've served me and this palace diligently. You've been steadfast, you've been loyal, and above all, you've been very hard working. So I must, I must say a very big thank you to you, Jacobia. You don't need to thank me now. It's, it's my work to protect you. It is what I signed him to do for you. So there is no need to give me all the praises. But, but all the same, thank you. I really appreciate. I appreciate you, my friend. I am supposed to appreciate you no matter what. Um, I want to increase your salary so that you can have enough to take care of yourself. <gasps> Oh, oh my god, oh my god. You see why I always talk about you? You see why I am so proud to be your friend? You are the highest king ever. King Ezoba, one of our community. May you live long. May you also live long. No, no, no. Hey, it's true. Uh, thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Thank you. I'll, I'll be outside. In case if you need me, anything you want me to, you already know what to do. Just call me, I'll come. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. You said you have something to discuss with me. Oh, yes, yes. Um, nothing much, really. Now, you see, uh, both of us, we have come a long way. Oh, yes. Uh, we have been through ups and downs. You know, I've been there for you. You know, I've shown that that um, act we call friendship. You know, starting from when you were not a king to when you finally, you know. <laughs> so, um, it's not really. Uh, very hard something I feel that you can uh, do for a long time friend you know so uh, let me just go straight to the point you see now so no who's um, position is vacant uh, so I don't think there's anyone that is qualified to be in that position if not your best friend so I am <laughs> Ah, Chikube, you can be very funny at times. I mean, you just sounded like one who is not from this part of the world. I mean, of course you know I can make you know. I can't. So you can now, you can't. I, don't know. I can't. Yes. <laughs> you should know I can't. Which one is you can't? I don't understand though. Why would you say you can't? Of course, who else do you want to make your know with, if, if not your best friend? Wait, wait, wait a minute, Jacob. Are you serious right now? Which one is that you, you, you cannot make me your know? So who else do you want to make your know? Uh, eh? Wait a minute, Jacob. Don't tell me you're serious about this. I thought you were joking. I should be the one to ask you. I thought you were, you were even joking. Because when I said it, you were laughing. I thought maybe you're, you're trying to yeah, digest what I said. Or you like the idea. You, you are the king of this kingdom. Whatever you say stands. What do you mean you, you, you cannot do it? If you say you cannot do that, that means you're, 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 you're just being corny. If you ask me, you're being corny. Hold on a minute. Yes, no doubt. I'm king. Uh -huh. But there are things I cannot do without... Listen, I thought you know those things. 
Onowu is an ancestral movement. Onowu is hereditary. Please leave this thing you're saying now. Which one is Onowu? Is Whatever you say in this village stands. If you call the, uh, uh, anybody to tell them that this is your new Onowu, everybody will respect that. Which one is your Onowu is hereditary? I didn't expect this thing from you. I was supposed to have this long conversation. It's not you just say, okay, my friend, thanks for reminding me. I will work on that. The next day, I'll come with my red cap and I'll become the Ono. Is there any other to, 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 to be done? Um, 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 um. Jacob, I cannot do that. I cannot incur the wrath of the gods all because I cannot do that. It's not possible. Is that, is that what you're telling me? I can make you. Is that what you're telling your friend for how many years? You're, you're telling me you cannot do this. You're telling me to my face. No problems. I know, I know your plan in this life is for me to serve you forever. It's for me to serve you forever without doing anything useful for me. Just this one thing that I'm begging. Just, just this one thing that you can easily close your eyes and do for me. You're telling me you can't. Okay, no problem. Uh -huh. Whitney sitting down. Is that it? Which one is that now? Will you stand up and greet me properly? So I greeted you, you so you even heard the greeting. You didn't even respond. Nothing, nothing. I should stand up and please let's let's know what we are doing. What was it? What's today's plan? What's the schedule for today? Jacoby, what F on tree, if I may ask? First is you now sit to address me. And secondly, look at the time you came to work. You and I were supposed to be at a meeting, a very important meeting by night. And this is 10 and you are still here seated and you're asking me questions. Have you lost it? Well, for the meeting, I it escaped my mind. I've been very busy at home. There's some personal things that I was sorting at home. Personal things that you forgot your work, you forgot the time that I gave you that we have to be at a meeting? Shall we? Shall we? It's not only shall we, it's willy willy. Shall we to wear? Taking enough of your excesses because we have been friends since childhood. Oh, you remember? I urge you to always not just give me that respect as your friend, but as your king. I'm very careful, Jacob. Shall we? <laughs> Can you just forget all this? <sighs> Leave all these things, it's not going to help us. So this place you're telling me to follow you to, am I following you there as what? Is it as Ono? Or I really want to know. Chikube, are we still talking about that matter, Ono? Of course we are still- No, we are not! I've told you countless times that Ono is hereditary. As we speak, Mazi Chirindu has been announced, has been pronounced the Ono of this great kingdom. And there is nothing I can do about it. Uh, hey. Earlier that you begin to understand this, Better for both of us. Now, can we? Kingdom is 
Kingdom against kingdom, fighting for the throne. And who is gonna be king? Heartless. I cannot believe that my childhood friend would do this to me. I have served you relentlessly. I have been there for you. Just this one thing, just this one thing that I beg of you, you cannot even do it for me. What you ask of me is something that has never been heard in the history of Ezoba Kingdom. My great grandfather did not do it, my father did not do it, I will not do it. The gods have already decreed who they want. It is hereditary. I've said this times without number. You are very, very, very wicked. I regret ever working for you as a PA. You look at me and, 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 and tell me your, your, your great father did... Me, after everything I did for you. After everything I did for you. Jacob, what did you do for me? Should I remind you that everything you did in this palace, all the work, I paid for it. You want me to talk about your family that I am taking care of. Everything about you is on scholarship. Who's footing the bill? Me! Be very careful with your utterances, Jacob. I'm beginning to get fed up of your excesses. You're asking me what did I do for you? You open your mouth to ask me. What did I do for you? And look, let me tell you. If you like, get angry. If you like, shout from now till morning. You must be very stupid. You're asking me what I did for you. Now let me tell you. You see this PA work? Today is the last day. I am done working for you as a PA. You can give to your note to whoever you like. That's, that's not a problem. It's fine. I have resigned. Jacobe. Chekube! You, you see you, you're, you're very wicked. You're a very wicked person. So your plan is for me to serve you forever now? Huh? Your plan is for me to keep opening doors for you, call you Chai Tanji of Ibo land, so your head will be big. You're very wicked. It's okay, I'm leaving the palace for you. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Please sit. Thank you very much, my king. Cha 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 cha! Did you come? Yeah. Come? Yeah. Come so no. Um. <clears throat> I thank you for this great honor. The Onowu is hereditary, and I thank God that you people go. I got into the tradition. Thank you very much. My king. Oh no. My king. Oh no. <laughs> My king. <laughs> oh no. Eh? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh and when I refused, he started parading himself as the next king of this great kingdom. What? what? You mean you wanted to be the next to know? Hey, 
Chekube. Why do you want to destroy this peaceful kingdom? Oh, is that the position you told me I am occupying when you kidnapped me? Ah, oh, Chekube, you are a bad person. I'm not a bad person. Don't judge me till you hear my own side of the story. This boy, this your so-called king, is a devil. He's heartless. I have a top secret about him that I've kept to myself for a very long time. But today, I will let every one of you know that he doesn't deserve to be the king. He doesn't deserve to sit on that throne. It happened years back during the reign of his grandfather. I'm so scared right now. Just calm down. Calm down. You have to put yourself together. But you would have listened to me. Eh? Chukume, please keep this as a secret. Please, don't tell anybody about this. If people get to find out about this, I will not become the king in the nearest future. My, uh, grandfather, my grandfather is 103 years. And my father will take after him tomorrow when he's no more. And I will take after my father. Please keep this as a secret, please, Jacobi. Obiora, it's all your fault. I told you let's go this way, but you said no. You said no. Oh God. But if keeping this as a secret will save your life, I would do it. Just that. Oh God. Ah, this was not intentional. Um, what are we going to do now? I don't know. I can't even think straight. I don't know. See, let's, let us go and bury her. Yes. Obiora. Yes. Are you this heartless? Would you... What if she was your sister? Please. Please. Please, you have to help me. You have to help me, Jekume. It's okay. I will do just that. Thank you. Let's go, but... They just go. Thank you. Thank you so much for bearing this secret within you all this while, without even telling anybody. <laughs> My prince, what are friends for? You are like a brother to me. I can do anything for a friend. Hey, what are you? My man, what you've done for me, there is nobody on this side that can do that. Oh. Chukube. My prince. Thank you so much for bearing this secret within you all this while, without even telling anybody. What are friends for my praise? See, you are like a brother to me. I can do anything for a friend. <laughs> <laughs> my friend, what you have done for me, there is nobody on this earth that can do that. Oh. 
You know what? I am going to bring you to the palace after my father's reign. <laughs> Wait. Are you saying that if you become the king, that I will live within the palace? Eh? You heard me correctly, Obiora. Hey. What you've done for me, there is nobody that can do that. And I promise to reward you abundantly. I heard you, my prince. My lady, you go for. <laughs> you just said you didn't ask you, I didn't request. <laughs> just start getting ready to join me. <laughs> Don't forget to me. Start getting ready to join me. <laughs> <My prince. laughs> so after he killed the girl, he buried her. He begged me, cried. I shouldn't let anyone know about it. He promised me that he will make me his second in command when he becomes the king. Now tell me, do you think that this boy here deserves to be the king after staining his hands with blood? Do you still think he deserves to be the king? My king. Is it true you have blood stain in your hands? I am telling you the fact. You're asking him if it's true. Does it look like King Chekube will lie to you? I have to verify. King Obiora, what you did was wrong. Instead of burying the girl, you should have brought her home. Exactly! Exactly what I told this boy. Let us take the poor girl home. Let's take her back to her people to give her a befitting burial. But he said no. He said no. He refused vehemently that he's, he's, he's going to bury her there. And you want this murderer to still be the king? Obiora is the king. So say the gods. He is the chosen one. If not, he would have been rejected on the day of his coronation. No, wait, I, I really don't understand. So, after everything I told you now, you're still calling him the king? Yes. He is the chosen one. <laughs> Obiora, you will go for cleansing so that the curse of the gods will not be incurred on your future generation. Well understood. What? Do what? Are we all being serious right now? Is that understood? As I'm more. Well understood, as a mom. I will do exactly what you have said. You still want this murderer to be the king? Oh. Tekube. That is enough. One more word. Hey. So you mean after telling them this, they still decided to accept a murderer as their king? God forbid. These people are me, no? They are senseless and stupid. Eh? Hi. It's okay. Yeah. Just calm down. Give me the bottle. Give me the bottle. Mm. Give me the bottle. Stop now. Drinking will not help it. See, it's okay. It's okay. Just calm down. Yeah. This is not the end. It is the beginning of a new Holy Bombo. Otsubi. Iyoji. Okalako. Holy Bombo. Otsubi. Iyoji. Anibuani. Okalako. 
Aria, Aria. The seven powers of our ancestors. We plead thee to have mercy. Forgive. And cleanse our king. Calm the spirit of the girl that was killed. Calm the spirit of the girl that was killed. And cleanse our land. The gods are merciful. The king and the elders in council have come to an agreement. This will be your final warning. No, stop talking nonsense here. See, let, let this be the last time you come here. If you come here next time, I will, I will order my boys to flog you. <laughs> Are you out of your mind? House. A life will be taken. The gods have spoken. Talk to me. How do you feel now? <coughs> My love, please. I am begging you. Please. Leave that throne for them. I don't want to do it again at all, at all. I am washing my hands like that of Pontius Pilate. I don't want to do it again, please. I don't want to die. The man nearly jokes me. I can't die, please. I'm not giving birth to the children. I want to give birth for you, please. I can't die now. Just leave the throne for them. I've been the one encouraging you. Now I'm discouraging you as your wife. Don't go for that, please. My love, whatever decision you take, I am solidly behind you. You have my support. <laughs> mm. That fool must be retarded to think that I will watch him rule over me and my people after what he did to me. Never would that happen. That is his own cup of tea. And trust me, my love, he will drink it. Whether he likes it or not, you are the king. The one and only king of Omoawoka. I'm still waiting for him to come and confront me. Of course, I know he must have heard that I'm now the new king of Awoka. We are not scared of him. Of course, we are not scared of him. You should be the one to be scared of me. <laughs> Prime, you have my support. In short, I am going to call my brother. You know he's not in Nigeria. He lives abroad and he has money. He is going to support us. Like, he will bombard us. He will throw enough money on us. <laughs> 
it must be fruitful. <laughs> you see why I love you so much? What would I have done without you by my side? You are so, so supportive. You are my biggest fan. You are that woman that believes in me so much. I love you so much. I love you more than you know. <laughs> and of course, it will definitely be fruitful. Nothing can stop us. Um, I love you. I have to dress up so that you can meet up with the youths. Please, your cap is heavy. How do you cope? Well, oh, it looks good in you. <laughs> Please. <coughs> Um, madam, I, I want to seize this opportunity to, to tell you that we are sorry. I want you to find it in your heart to, to forgive us. Um, yeah. That's five million naira. It's nothing actually, but just, just a way of telling you how sorry we are. Please, accept it. My king, please take this money away. I don't need this check. Will five million naira bring my son back to life? Agnes. We are sorry. I know five million naira cannot bring back your son. But at least it can go a long way. Biko, accept it. My king, please. Allow me mourn my son in peace. Please. All right, madam. But I also want you to know that if you need anything, do not hesitate to let me know. Once again, I'm sorry. Yeah. 